Okay, so welcome back everyone. Before that break, I crashed the game. I shouldn't say I crashed the game. I don't know if I did anything to actually cause the game to be crashed, but the game crashed. Uh, and I, despite getting a 5.30 roughly time in Strando Beach, I'm going to move on now to Monto Mountain. So this starts with like the one of the toughest speed techs in the game. But I think I've figured it out more. It's about big jumps. Ah! Ah! Gotta jump earlier. That was way too slow of an exit. See? Big jumps. See? Yeah! Yeah, so that's the, the first level there. Like I said, hard speed trick right at the start. close. All right. We got some screeching happening. This is uh, obviously I'm not timing it. This one I'm just mostly looking to remember what is in these levels and stuff like that. Easy. That level is pretty easy no matter what. I, uh, that's that was fine with me obviously as I play these levels I'm gonna get faster okay So I think for this one, I will need to, like, pause and hesitate. This one, however... Yep, okay. This one, there's no reason to rush, because... You can't really make it to this platform earlier. So, like, if you want to wait, like, 
be my guess and stuff like that, but... Yeah, that's a basic strat. Pretty good. I think for this one, it's mostly going to just be not messing up and not dying. Not spending too much time on springs. easy there's just not really many ways of speeding it up That was real fast smashing on the boss there. And then we get this boss. Who may be more so than the last one is a frustratingly RNG dependent. Isn't too bad. Let's uh let's do another playthrough. Let's do another playthrough of everything. Oh. What the fuck? There we go. Ah, come on! This one I also death looped on during my practice. Oh, 
Yeah, okay, that was good. No! Uh, not terrible, but I'm not exactly excited about that one. That was Ultra Instinct there. <laughs> that was me just uh, seeing things and reacting. All right. And boom. I feel like this is a level I'm going to death cycle a lot on. There we go. First try every time. Okay, so I think the way I'm supposed to do this in terms of speed tech is jump here and then here. Nope. Oh, jeez. Well, eh, either way. I'll try that speed tech, but... Okay. Yeah, there we are. <laughs> I'm an idiot. Yeah. 
I'm an idiot. Okay. Okay, boss time. Okay. All right. Should I do Yeah, I should just do some uh some runs now. I don't think I'm going to die as much as I did in the last world. I don't think I'm going to die as much as I did on Strato Beach, but I think the time saves are going to be significantly worse. Hold on. Let me I gotta bring up the the thing. All right. So where's where's my splitter? Did I did I close it? I guess I must have closed it. Okay. Bring up live split. We are playing on Monto Mountain. There we go. All right. So. Definitely there's some death cycling that is possible to happen on the first level, but also I could restart the first level. Also, let's edit this and start to point seven. Yeah. All right, so the times I got, they range between seven minutes, 43 seconds which I'm pretty sure I can beat. Then we have some uh, times closer to 6.30, 6.15, and then it goes all the way to 5.30. I don't know how they did that, but I'm looking to aim somewhere around the 6.30 mark today, so we're going to go with that. So, uh, da -da -da -da. okay. All right. And then three, two, one. All right. All right. Three, two, one. It really is going to be I either uh, succeed on this jump or I restart. Three, two, one. Oh. Three, two, one. All right. Three, two, one. All right. Yep. And up. What? No! Okay, well, I guess I'm restarting this level for a different reason than not getting the, the first jump. Alright. Three, two, one. Alright. Three. Three, two, one. That was very slow. There, okay. Three, two, one. Three, two, one. 
three, two, one. Fucking hell, really? Three, two, one. Ha <laughs> ha! So close. Three, two, one. I was mashing too much there. Three, three, two, one. There we go. Yep. Yep. And last one. There we go. Okay, we got a run on the go. All right. Yo, Blake. How's it going? Ah, the moonwalk. That's funny. How's it going today? Hope you're having an excellent day. Thanks for subscribing, as usual. Really appreciate you. Except for the Minecraft April Fool's uh, enjoyment. How is uh, your day going so far? Twenty nine months. I'm going to allow the, these to sneak in. Yeah. All right. Yeah, that was pretty long. Okay, there we go. Yeah, I, I watched a bit. I watched a fair bit. I was like lurking a lot of the time because I was playing my own games and uh, making food and stuff like that while you were streaming yesterday. But I, I did watch. And uh, I saw the whole Moon April Fools thing, how you have to get a get on a cow and stuff like that. Weird, weird and cool stuff. So. I mean, you seem pretty pleased with it, so I take it successful Minecraft April Fool's joke. At one point, you, you said exactly what I was thinking. They went all out for an April Fool's joke. Oh, this level takes like a minute to complete.
Like, they could have really, like, half-assed something, but no, they were like, Oh no, there's a real moon, there's a way to get there. There, the blocks include half blocks while you're on the moon. It's gonna be made of cheese. It's cheese, Gromit. Oh my god. Ah! I don't want to reset because I do want to set a time at the very least, so I'm just annoyed that I keep uh, hitting into things. I don't know why I'm choking right now. There we go. Wow, two minutes and 14 seconds. You think I can improve on that? That was so dumb of me. Are you kidding me? Well, know what? This thing wasn't going to PB anyway, so... Might as well fuck up the boss big time. It's a time! A time has been set. Alright. Yes, I want to update these times. Okay. Alright. All right, let's go again. In three, two, one. 
Oh, first try. Never mind. Yeah. All right. Three, two, one. Three, two, one. Fuck off. Let me just see here. Hmm, weird. Okay. World three. Yep. Speaking of world three, three... Two, one. Mm. There we go. All right. Three, two, one. All right. I'm starting to get the timing on it. But since it's like the first trick of the uh of this run, I'm going to keep doing it. Okay. There we go. Four seconds saved already. Whoa! You ever go so fast you kill yourself? Yeah, of course I I lost some times. I killed myself. All right. Also died a few times on this level if I recall correctly. Fourteen seconds saved. I could have made that. All right. Oh, I apparently had data that needed to update. <laughs> Who knew? There I go. I'm just saving time after time. There we go.
All right. And then we have this level here, which I definitely death cycled on. Hey, look at that! I saved a minute thirty. <laughs> sorry, sorry about yelling there. I'm just like, that is a load of time save. And we're gonna see another one here. Cause I definitely fucked up. That was a good exit. Two minutes and 11 seconds ahead. <laughs> Fuck off. That sucks. <laughs> Boom! 618! That definitely puts me in some spots. Uh, hold on here. Six, eighteen, seven, five, uh, two, five, roughly, okay. Thank you for the GG Leica. I'm just gonna do a quick check to see where that positions me for 618. Yeah, do I want to save these? Of course I want to update them. Alright, 618. Well, I beat, uh, Leica. Sorry about that. So, uh, I'm about a second slower than the next people, so I would still RIP you. Yeah. I would still be, um, I would still like to shave off a few seconds so I can get closer to 615, uh, 610, something like that. So, I definitely think I could do it. I went in the wrong direction. Sorry. I'm gonna do, 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 move this over here. Okay. Yeah. I forget that just holding to the uh, left isn't enough. You have to actually know which direction you're going in. All right. And I think a big thing of time save here is this corner trick. Like. This will save a lot of time if you can master it. So, three, two, one. Ah! The first jump wasn't big enough. All right. Three, two, one. There it is. Second try, I'll take it. Nope. Oh. 
There we go. <laughs> All right, definitely getting more confident with this level. Hey, no death. And there we go. Hey, four seconds of time save. Of course, there was four seconds. There was no death. Also, if the boss could cooperate, I definitely have some time save there as well. Like, the, this, this part, there is no speed tech, so. Yeah. Yep. Hey, look at that gold split again. All right, and boop. Hey! Seven minutes ahead, or seven seconds ahead. Oh my god, seven minutes ahead. I'd be already done this world. All right. There we go. There we are. Hey, another gold split. No! Oh! There goes all my time save!
Oh boy. Oh man. That sucks. Not only start losing your time save, but have lost it during the penultimate part of the run. Well, this... Ah! Look at that! Ah! If I hadn't lost that much time, that would have been a really good run. That would have been a really good run. Let's update my best of times, which are now sitting at pretty close to six minutes, so... Getting 610 shouldn't be too hard for me. Nope. And next week, uh, by next week, I'll need to practice the last two levels, Fungo Cave and uh, the castle. All right. Let's go again. Three, two, one. That was really slow of me to come out, so. Three, two, one. All right. Three, two, one. Okay, let's practice this. Yeah, I, I'm just, I'm being a bit too, like, fast is the problem. I need to not mash as much and just concentrate on getting as much air as possible there. So, three, two, one. All right, let's try this. Hmm. That was closer. Still closer. Nope. There we go. All right. Three, two, one. I do it as soon as I stop timing myself. Three, two, one. As soon as I stop timing myself. No, what? I'm just gonna leave that false start in. I'm not leaving that one in, though. All right. Three, two, one. There we go. That's a first try. Uh, I could have probably made that one. Ugh. Okay. Let's go once more. Into the brink, my friends. Three, two, one. <laughs> All right. 
three, two, one. It's weird to say that in terms of speed strats, this first level is the hardest one. Anyways, three, two, one. That was faster. Yeah, look at that. Two seconds saved. All right. Oh! Yeah, my confidence on that level definitely increased. Six seconds of time save there. As fuck! Ooh. Gold split, of course that's a gold split. I could have made that. Okay, slight time loss, nothing to cry about. Ten seconds ahead. All right. All right. Beautiful timing.
All right. No mess up. We just have a final boss to deal with. Oh, baby. Oh man, could this be sub six? Oh my god! Oh, -hoo -hoo! oh -ho -ho, baby! All right. Ah. Uh. What a time! 5.56! Alright, do I want to update them? Yes. Uh, let me just double check a few things here. So... Yeah, show rules. Yeah. It's the first frame of the 180 spin after touching the child. So, touch the child, then turn around. Yeah, so I got that in 50... In uh, 5 minutes, 56 seconds. That puts me at number 3. And top for the Switch, by the way. If I'm separating this just by Switch... Uh... No. Yeah, I'm not I'm not top of switch for anything except Monto Mountain. Ah, oh, that felt so good. Oh my god, do I keep even going after that? Do I keep playing after that? That was so good. I kind of feel like stopping. Uh I don't think I'm going to do better than that. Let's find, let's just end it here. No, no, let, let's not end it here. Let's save that. We're, we're going to save. And I'm going to practice the, the next couple levels. I'm going to practice Fungo Caves and the Castellus Fortress. So we're going to play through those. Kind of refresh myself on what's going on here. We are going to reset. That can be done a lot smoother, I know that much. This one I have played off stream recently. I didn't need to jump there. This one. There we go. That one I either do like right away perfectly or it takes me 600 attempts. Okay. Yeah, okay. Huh. 
Whoa, that was so close. I, I reached to press the space bar on my computer because I'm so used that after I finish a level, I slam that space bar. This one, I know there's a faster way. It's definitely not that. That's not faster. Gonna have to watch the the runs. Man. See if I could hop on one of those. I'm sure there's probably a a runner somewhere who like has it super super figured out what the the timing is so I'm gonna have to watch some people Ooh, watch them closely Watch. Make sure. Make sure. I, again, I was reaching for the space bar there. Oh. And there we go. First try. Well, okay. I guess I'm letting you go first. Whoa! Going too fast there. So this one I have to let the hot dog go first. Oh, I can't even hang out that close to it. Like, ah, that's so weird. Like, I can just get ahead of it, but doesn't like that I do. Yeah, okay, so that level is easy so long as I don't try to get ahead. Like, Hmm, again, I feel like I was going too fast there. the boss.
There we go. That was easy. Not really much for Fungo Caves. It's level two so far has been the most difficult one. Then we got Durnak Castle or whatever it's called. That's how you're supposed to do it. I remember there being some uh, skips and things available there. Alright. These guys always upset me. How close or how far am I supposed to be from them? Yeah, that's pretty far. All right. Wow, that time I just I just outright touched him. Okay, let's just do the stage for real here. All right. All right. And I gotta deal with these fuckers again. Explosion is so fucking huge. Oh, my gosh. How's it going, Maddie? Uh, I'm doing pretty good. I got some decent times on uh, World 2 and 3, so I decided to just uh, chill and s uh, refresh myself. Happy to see you here. Yeah. Uh, I'm just uh, chilling and checking out what uh, World 5 is like. Play through World 4, but oh my god, World 5 is giving me the biggest pain in the ass. All right. <laughs> that time it wasn't even the cans that were giving me a problem. It was just straight up the uh it, the the player. The Leo. Leo is giving me the problem. Yeah, World 5 is It's the hitboxes on these uh, Coke cans. Fuck! The hitboxes on these Coke cans, I don't really get. So I'm gonna have to look up like some guides on where to stand for each explosion and stuff like that. I know for these guys, like... What? No! 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 You know you can overjump coke. Yeah, I mean... 
But see, like, I still died there. I can keep trying, sure. I have to double jump before you it it. I... Why would I hit it, though? I might... What do you mean too early? You were saying I had to do it before. I have to be next to them? Nope, still got hit by the explosion there. No, that time I didn't. Okay, I think I I think I'm starting to get it now. Ah, I see what you're supposed to do. All right, that's cool. close. Okay, now I understand how it works. Whoop! Well, at least it'll give me more time to practice. Ah, oh, thanks for the follow. I thought you were already following from the last stream. Gotta be honest. But, well, thanks for the follow either way. Whether it was uh, from last time or this time. The fuck is your problem? All right. Well, let's just finish this level. All right. Where are we now? Where? We now. Ah, oh, this level's fun. That level's just fun. I'm sure I could do uh, the jumps without the balloons there, too. Uh, but like I said, I think I want to look up some guides. Oh, man. I want to look up some guides and see, like, a better idea on the timing of things. Fuck off. <laughs> Man, now that I get the timing on that jump, these, uh, these coke cans seem a lot easier. That, that one, not so much, but... Because it's just, I, it, I get it. It's like you do a single hop over them, and then once you're over them, you do a double jump to avoid the explosion.
See? Like... I get it. That's actually really cool. It makes these guys a lot easier. Also, when I first played this game, I thought it was the, like, shrapnel that hurt you. Clearly, it's not. I thought it was, like, the little cans. Whoops. I thought you had to avoid like the little the red uh, cans that pop out from afterwards. Probably could have kept uh, just outrunning the hot dog. I mean, I definitely could. And now I wait. Got a bit too close there. <laughs> yeah, rip. Ah, I could have hopped over the last one. So the fungal caves I don't think are going to take uh, much for me to work with, but... Uh, excuse me? Uh, excuse me? What's that hitbox? Okay, I'm gonna come back to you later. That one, I feel like you'd have a good hitbox, yeah. Yeah, I feel like this one, it's... I don't think you can jump over it because the ceilings make it so that you're still... Yeah, you... Uh, yes, you can? What? Well, I need... A jump before. Oh, jeez. Okay. Yeah, that's not happening. I'm gonna have to look up how uh, this one does it. I don't think it's impossible. Well, okay. Everything except for that one Coke is, uh, I got figured out. I got the, the timing right and everything, but uh, that one is giving me trouble. I might practice this, uh, last stage again. Fuck. Fick. Fick. 
I jumped into the pizza there. Something tells me that's not the winning strategy. Jump into an enemy. No! But I love you, pizza. Oh, well, that was too late. so much. How could it hurt me like this? There it is. Jeez. Ever try Italian pizza? Uh, I've never been to Italy, so I can't say I have. Oh my god, really? Okay, that works. Eh. I've had some more like gourmet pizza from some pizza places and stuff like that. But uh, I don't know what makes a pizza like authentically Italian. I'm gonna be honest, so. I'm just gonna do a blanket no answer to that. Ah. There we go. Just don't panic and stand in the corner. No, oh, this level. Ah, just scroll. 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 Oh, come on. Okay. All right. I do like that this level's like a grand culmination of everything you've learned. It's not like, no, here's some uh, brand new gimmick that you don't know about. No, it's 
here's legitimately like you should have been paying the entire game here's how you deal with the falling blocks here's how you deal with uh, uh, the the switches like have you been paying attention Oh, that sucked. Okay, so... I think, uh... Part of figuring out this level is gonna be... Figuring out the... Left, right, left pattern. It's obviously here, that's faster. But here on this side, you don't want to be over there. What? No! Jeez. Alright. And you're making me hungry for pizza now, Maddie. All right. It's the final boss time. Italian, nice. I know some Italian. Well, sorry, I shouldn't say I know Italians. I know descendant of Italians. Some people with Italian ancestry. I know Canadians with Italian ancestry. Is how I'm gonna put it. Which it, I'm gonna put it that way because that's accurate. There we go. You live in Italy. Okay, nice. Yeah, I've never had a Italian pizza. I've never been to Italy. I live in, I live in Canada. So, a game by Tom Young. Thanks, Nikki Thompson. Thanks, Hadley Donaldson. Thanks, John Monroe. And it's 22.50 p.m. It is... Uh, 5.50 p.m. here, so you're about five hours ahead of me. So. I mean, I suppose for you, I don't start at too bad of a time for, uh, streaming and stuff like that. Mm, Daddish will return in Daddish 2. Yeah, but will the possum return in Daddish 2? I, I like, uh, I mean, it's pretty neat when you can see a game just composed of uh, a seven-person team. That's, uh, that's crazy interesting. <laughs> nice. All right, that's going to be it for me today. So we're going to call that uh, done uh, for, t <laughs> for today. Thanks uh, for watching.